I am so happy waking up in the woods this morning. It's about 8.30, the sun is shining, birds are chirping. It's gonna be such a good day. My best buddy beside me is snoozing in this morning. And let me show you around where we found, well, I guess I can show you some of the clips of how we found this place. Trees everywhere. Are you stuck? No, no, I'm not stuck. Is trend marked? Trend is good. The trend might be scratched. Scratched is okay, but like. Not stuck. <laughs> oh, it's such a beautiful night. Eamon was trying to pull down a side road. That's not gonna work. That is not gonna work. Okay, we're continuing on this mission. As you can see, Trinity's pulled over there. There's another little road to explore. Good. Perfect, huh? <laughs> I think so. And what it looks like now that camp's all set up. Oh, we got some neighbors this morning. Hi. Morning, you two. <laughs> what are you guys up to? Just reading my book. Nice. Fixing the gear loft. Fixing the gear loft. Love it. How was the sleep? It was hot. 10 out of 10. We were sleeping a little bit this way last night, but no big deal whatsoever because... Because... I once read this article about this 90-year-old woman who, or maybe she was even older, but she was thriving. She did yoga every day and she had two tips to give to everyone on how to live like a really healthy, full life. Number one was to go vegetarian or vegan. And number two was to wake up every morning and say this is gonna be the best day ever. So guys. This is gonna be the best day ever! Today is gonna be the best day ever. Let's crash. In case you don't know, God. this is the beautiful Dana Dawn. What's up, YouTube? <laughs> and this is Chef Bird's Frizz. You already know. <laughs> <laughs> yep, you already know. He's a nutter. If you guys ever uh, get the opportunity to sleep over at our place, we do have a pretty nasty tea, tea collection. So, Bird's Frizz is being a little picky. <laughs> Doing them a custom blend. So we got some fresh strawberries, and we're doing steel-cut oats. Make sure you cook them long enough. I got it there. Beck's always on me not for not always. cooking them long enough. And then we're trying out Cliff's new granola. We're going to dump that on top. We went to this really cool farmer's market yesterday in the Victoria area, and we got all these fruits and veggies that taste amazing. Yeah. We didn't even know that there could be that much of a difference. When we were eating snap peas and they tasted like candy. Honestly, like if you guys have never had like real produce before, like things that come in like little blue containers like this, holy smokes. <laughs> These tomatoes, they don't, they, they legit taste more like licorice than. No, they taste more like a grape than a tomato. Yeah. They taste so sweet and delicious. Crazy. And these strawberries are the same thing. Typically when Eamon makes steel cut oats, um, the bowl arrives in front of me as he just did. And it is so chewy. It's kind of inedible. But we've all encouraged him to cook it longer, so we'll see how we go. I can't do that, okay. Mmm. Cooked! Bit of a heated domestic broke out. Might have had something to do with my gas. <laughs> it's so gross. Why don't you go to the toilet? <laughs> I don't need to go to the toilet. Just go force it out. There's no toilet, buddy. Yeah, We're so in the wilderness. So go to the woods, the wilderness. May I have the shovel, please? You need the shovel? Yep. It's important to dig a nice big hole so you don't affect nature, right? Try it. Okay, so I'm gonna close this. Anything yeah, else? it'll just be a sec here. Before I leave? <laughs> We're good. Okay. Let's go! Yesterday on our hunt for a good place to park, we saw this primo camp spot. We were so envious, so we're just gonna show you around. Someone was here, but holy smokes, this is incredible. Well, is that like a little campfire pit? Yeah. Wow. 
bit interesting when you travel with other people. Obviously, ev everyone's super chill and we're all down to kind of do whatever, but Eamon and I have priorities of, you know, making great content and taking great photos. And so this campsite is really appealing to us, but Fraser and Don kind of want to just keep going, which I get because I don't know what there is to do in, this, in these parts. So we'll see. Oh. Sorry, Petunia. Yikes. I just quickly pulled over. There's a town. There's a town. There's a company in town that actually rents the, the uh, tubes that we're thinking about hitting up. This, I think this town, the main thing to do is hit up the river. So there's a lot of places that sell tubes. You can also rent them. We're just trying to figure out what we want to do. It's a little bit overcast, calling for rain this afternoon. Maybe we'll hit it up for an hour, see how it is. Why not? We were gonna make <clears throat> like a sandwich packed lunch, but sandwiches didn't get packed. We're already eating it. Either we're gonna rent it. Yeah. Which it comes inflated and you get a paddle. And you get a four person tube. And if we're 60 not. Bucks, yeah. Or we could buy our own cooler tubes for 13 bucks, but you don't get a paddle. The singles would be kind of fun. Let's just get the four personer. Fraser and Eamon get the two personer. Yes. Okay, are we going or what? Literally have the hardest time making decisions. <laughs> we finally just made a decision. We're about to execute. Mm -hmm. It started raining. We're still gonna do it anyways because we're yeah. crazy. You guys want to do it in the rain? The big thing to do with this river run is to get Everyone alcohol. Really now, I don't usually drink. I haven't drank in like at least six months. I would drink like one so everyone's thinking about it so i took the instagram and we're gonna let instagram vote on whether we're gonna trade in my sober six month coin <laughs> for a case of beer are you voting 26 said yes seven said no you want to see who said no it's probably like jerry and bob <laughs> squad at the rental place is trying to upsell us they're saying this four person might not fit I don't know. It's just, it's just if you guys I, think it's comfortable, go for it's it. It's not just that comfortable. You have to engage your ass yeah. to like sit. Yeah, I mean, so what do you want to do? Two of these? No, but how is that going to be more comfortable? Well, then you can literally like, just, then you can just moss. Oh. Just get the Bud Lights flowing and just... <laughs> Ryan's hooking us up with the Rolls Royce of tubes here. So, pretty stoked. We were planning on that. This is going to be a much more... We're upgrading to that. Okay, we're out here in Port Alberni. Couple of good Canadian books, having a couple of Are Bud you Lights. I can't see you right oh yeah. Okay. Okay, ready? Okay, squad. To cold water. Cold water. I guess they've given me the tube. Also, I went back and got the Bluetooth speaker. But I'm pulling the beers. <laughs> I've never seen anyone laugh at themselves so hard. See if you can get it in the net. Oh. I want to give a little shout out to Turret. They sent us this cooler and we've been testing it out. It's been awesome. Totally waterproof. Fits a ton of extra groceries. And when we are drinking once a year, it will fit your cold beer. We are heading into the rapid section. Class four. Beck left. She's literally gone. And it's the point of the vlog where Fraser Phrase does something stupid. Holy jibber jabber. <laughs> what, is, what is the plan now? You gotta give her, you got no electronics in there? Pop. No, it's gonna pop. <laughs> no, if you land, hold on. I let me... know you're thinking something. Like <laughs> you land butt in, you'll be fine. <laughs> I'm wasted. I can't, I've never vlogged Wasted before. Let's turn it off. <laughs> really? <laughs> yeah. We're back at the van. Things have quieted down quite a bit. I'm not sure what the footage before this looked like or how it turned out. But we had a little bit of a crazy day, which is a one-off for all of us, I think. But it was a lot of fun. It is pouring rain here. We were going to drive back to that beautiful campsite you guys saw this morning. But the rain and the work that we would have to do to pitch a tent and all that kind of stuff has deterred us and it seems like we're gonna be sleeping in this parking lot. And we're gonna be putting Fraser and Dawn in here. 
Who's excited? What happened the first time you slept? We slept four in here. The worst sleep of my life. Worst sleep of your life. Hands down, worst sleep. What happened? I had to sleep in a hammock. <laughs> it was brutality. Think about your worst sleep in your life and then times that by 15. <laughs> That's what I had. The last time we slept, everyone. We pitched a hammock between that rib and that rib. Yep. And the hammock was heavy slow. Yeah. Almost like a 60 degree angle. It was rough. And tonight, I'm not And Dawn sure. slept with her feet under our walkway here and her head out there. But Fraser's refusing to do the hammock again, which I totally understand. So I think what we're gonna do is try to fit them both. Are you gonna put your head out towards or your feet out that way? <laughs> Joy and pleasure to millions of music lovers. I love it. We are sleeping four people in our sprinter van, <laughs> and that's what's happening. Are you comfy, Dean? So warm. Your feet might be cold. Chef. <laughs> uh, I'm great, dude. A little bit inverted, but you gotta invert daily. A so. little bit inverted. <laughs> Are you comfy though? That's almost more than hard. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're hanging uh, in there. I wouldn't worry about Beck and I. I got my two pillows. I'm good. What an eventful Sunday here on Vancouver Island. Very fun afternoon. Hope you enjoyed coming along for the ride. The ride it was. <laughs> Yep. Anything else? We'll see you in the next one. I'm going back on that non-alcohol vibe starting tomorrow. Phone call? Oh, late for a phone call. Okay, guys, that Christian. House Malone? What's up, dude? I'm just signing off a vlog. You want to help us? <laughs> Don't show the phone number like you always do. All right. I got your back, Christian. <laughs> Hope you guys enjoyed the video. You better like it, and you better subscribe to this channel, and you better not read this number and call me. <laughs> like what happened last time I put my, my phone call on the blog. Okay, Until bye. Until next time, guys. Bye. What's up, dudes? What's up? Yo, what's up? How's your sleep? Oh, this is number two worst sleep of my life. <laughs> <laughs>